thought I'd do a video on this TSTtruck.com. This is a tire pressure monitoring system uh, that's just running off a USB connection for power. And this is the display unit uh, that I am using. And I'm using this actually on a travel trailer. Uh, so this is mounted inside the vehicle. And let me show you where I've installed the actual tire pressure monitoring on the Casita travel trailer. You can see it has a locking ring and you basically come out and install that in line uh, on each of your tires. And then you can in line uh, add or take pressure out without having to remove this. When you get this now, there'll be a little tool that comes with it that helps you to lock this on here and you can use that to unlock it to remove it, you know. And I set, it lets you set parameters and when to give you warnings and so forth. And there's one of these on each side. Let me show you the other side here. And if you're like most of us, you're probably running your tire pressure somewhere between 55 to 60 PSI. So you're gonna set a range of which you want that to give you a warning. This thing will monitor temperature of tires as well as the PSIs. Uh, I've had this on my trailer now for a couple years. Uh, I did go in one time and have to change the batteries in these. And again, you'll have a tool to remove this. You can take it in. You'll need a jeweler's uh, tiny screwdriver to open that up and replace the battery and all. But it does give you a peace of mind. It will register and constantly monitor the tire pressure from inside the vehicle. Now, installation is pretty straightforward because it's, for the most part, a wireless system. However, in my model, they do send you an extension piece. It's just an antenna. I did go ahead and wire that in. The reason for this is if you go in long distances between that monitor and the tire pressure, then you're going to want to have this extension piece. Now, I don't think I was quite really, uh, well, I wasn't too far, but since it came with it, I went ahead and wired it in anyway. And it's worked great. Now, it does take some time once you start your vehicle uh, and you've powered it inside the vehicle here. It does take some time for the monitoring to kick in. Uh, Again, it's a primarily a wireless system, and what happens is when you kick the power on, it's going to take a minute to read. And let me plug mine in here so you can at least see the display unit. And you can see the display unit coming on, and you can see it's blank basically. Uh, but what will happen is after a several minutes. It'll start reading the temperature and the PSI. And since I'm only using basically two tires in this configuration, it'll have to register each one independently and then gradually it'll rotate constantly, it continually rotates and reads those tires. So you can watch that temperature and PSI. You can see it's already picked up one tire. Now, after a bit, it'll pick up that second tire. So, but anyway, it plugs in internally and uh, you keep that inside your vehicle and it'll monitor the tire pressure for you continuously as well as the temperature of your tires and all. Okay, hopefully this is helpful and there's the, uh, uh, the tsttruck.com site. Uh, but I'm sure you can buy this probably from Amazon or any locations.